Kimmy, I still remember the first time I laid eyes on you. Albeit through a cracked iPhone, I was immediately struck by your beauty, athletic background, and even your religion. Before even speaking to you, I knew that you were special, and though I stumbled through our initial conversation, I was determined to get to know you and to bridge our geographical gap. I remember being amazed early on how much we had in common. While your beauty is what initially drew me in, it is now an afterthought to all the amazing qualities you possess. I never thought I would find my best friend who I'm truly madly in love with, someone who excites me every single day. With you, I've discovered the true meaning of fate and true love. So Patrick, I promise to respect you, your thoughts, opinions, and actions. I promise to sacrifice for you when you need me to. I will sacrifice and give you priority. I promise to protect you from all types of harm. I promise to support you through the hardships in life. I vow to always be the person you can rely on. And I promise to be there for you in your hopes and dreams. You are caring, goofy, funny, driven, and are probably the most empathetic person that I've ever met. Your views and the way in which you approach life could not be more different on some fronts. Far from an annoyance, I love the different point of view you provide because it causes me to question and evaluate ways in which I can improve as both a person and a partner. There is one thing that I will promise you, that I will always be there. There can be no light without darkness, and I will always be by your side whether it's a sunny day or it's dark and stormy. I'm not me without you, Kimmy. I love you so much, and I cannot wait to see what life brings us. I want to express my love and gratitude for you. You've accepted me for who I am, embracing all my imperfections and quirks. Your love has given me the confidence to unapologetically be myself, and I am forever grateful for that. I will love you and honor you all these days of my life. Patrick and Kimmy, today you make a pledge to and for each other. Not as individuals, but as two choosing to become one. Seek strength from each other, give hope to each other, and let your trials help you grow together. By the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Patrick, you may kiss the bride. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it is with great honor that I present to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Rogers. I'm thrilled you two little lax lovers found each other again and have invited us to celebrate your love together. May you have bountiful years of fun in the sand, in the snow, <laughs> and finding new surfing you want music to share with the rest of us. I love you both dearly. It says like get you hitched because I was gonna do this last night, but um, we got you hitched. So congratulations! I love you both. Cheers. It's truly amazing when you find the right person, one that understands you better than you understand. One that will pick you up if you fail, and one that always has your back no matter what. You two are so tight, you always have your back, and you have your back. I, I think it's really a good thing. You're both really good people, and you want the best for the other. And, and that's like the best thing you can possibly have. Cheers. Love you all. Thank you.